Hey, what's up, guys? It's Ant here. And today we are going to make a texture text effect in Photoshop. OK, only thing we have to do, open up Photoshop and let's get some layers together. So we'll head on up to file. Click on open. Grab our background layer right here. OK, so what we'll do with this is we will head back up to file and let's go down to save as and what we'll do is we'll think of a name for the texture and we will call it let's see texture text effect how about texture text that looks good hit save that part is done so now all we have to do is let's drop in a text layer here and we can call it texture. Okay, let's see. We want to enlarge this but keep the proportion. So Alt and Shift and pull it out. Apply that. Now let's take this background layer out. And that looks good for our purpose here. So what we'll do is we'll take our text layer, right click on it and convert it to a smart object. All right, there we go. Now we head up to filter and go down to distort, click on displace. Now displace has a few options here. If you really want to go, uh, if you really want to exaggerate a lot, then the higher the horizontal and the vertical scale, the more exaggerated the texture will be. So I think maybe 10 and then 10 will work. So we'll hit OK here. And now the only thing we have to do is click on our texture or our displacement mat we just made and hit open. And there we have it. that's it that's it so we want to change the color here let's double click on this and we are going to do a color overlay or we can do a gradient overlay whichever you choose let's see let's go to maybe some oranges see what they got going on hit okay there we go that looks good but <laughs> Ooh. all right now so if you want to change the uh, displacement map here just go ahead and right click on it on this little button down here and then hit edit smart filter and then you can change the horizontal scale if that's not looking enough for you then you can change that let's just do that just for for our learning purposes hit ok and see what we'll do Hit the texture text again and open. It's a little bit more dramatic, but looks good as well. All right, I think that one will do it. And that's it. That's all we have to do, guys. That's all we have to do to create a texture text effect in Photoshop. Like always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.